Anything less than 3k is a good price. Could I try? Should I see if I can get him down to like 1.5? No, you'll never find someone to sell it for 1.5 ever. Well, I'm gonna see if this guy will sell it to me for 1.5 then. He would be challenge retarded. accepted, Bryce. <laughs> the cheapest I've ever seen a crate ever be sold for is like 2k. Would you sell me that crate for 1.5k? Uh, 1,500 for the crate. Uh, I think I'll stick firm at 1.5, but uh, that way if you want to sell it, I'll take it. If not, uh, I guess there's not a huge need for it, but uh, since you got it, I'm somewhat interested in it. Okay, let me just hit up the ATM real quick. He's going to sell it to me for 1.5. He wants to get rid of it. Wow. I'm going to go over there right now and tell him that that's a, that's a bad price. Okay. I got the 1.5. Oh, what's up? Got it. Oh, boy, great. Thank you, oh, sir. Boy, great. Are you selling that? Are you fucking one spam? I'll sell it to you for three thousand. No, how about you can't pull that new man? Deal. A duffel bag and everything. Look at your ass. Hey, James. I'll sell it to you for 2.5. Let's just step right over here for a second. Yeah, I did. I just did. I just, oh, you did? I just did by the yeah. What's in it? Uh, your hopes uh, and dreams at the mining. moment. Oh, shit. What's in the box? <laughs> I think that guy's going to try to sell it back immediately, no. just kind of like I did. My uh, brother, Marcus, in game, told me that 1.5 is a steal, and it kind of was because we immediately sold it for 2.5k, and, uh,. It was really nice, so we're going to go ahead and deposit the amount that we have currently to put it in here. And, uh, yeah, we made a thousand dollar profit in a matter of just seconds. And, uh, that's definitely how I want to do business. We might try to start, uh, flipping things. Maybe vehicles. That wouldn't actually be too bad. Buying a really cheap vehicle, changing the paint just to make it look a little snazzy, maybe add some neon lights. Um, a lot of people tend to like those. And then try to make five to even ten thousand dollars on top of it just by making it look like a nicer car paint wise would be really a great way to make money hopefully that is obviously it would be uh have to be tested but uh ideally it'd make great profit big margins that is what's going on over here um we got a call about a guy who's in talking truck shooting oh, okay my name Oh, my name is Leo. Oh, Le second is Larson. Leo Larson. I actually uh, attempted to, uh, I guess, uh, submitted an application to uh, your guys' line of work, but uh, got declined and said you guys were close. Are you guys not hiring? or? Okay, dang, okay. So, uh, yeah, trying to go in your kind of line of work, some sort of, you know, security or safeguarding. Yeah, no, I know. They should be, uh, I don't know when they might be. It's got a large group of, uh, cadets and all that stuff, so I think you might have to wait a little bit. Nothing to do with, uh, uh applications or recruitment process, but they might reopen soon. Okay, yeah, no problem. And, um, I guess, do you guys know any sort of like time frame for uh, the, uh, I guess, firearm permits on how long it takes? Uh, only a few well, days. feels like a day. I mean, my ticket one feels like a day. But... It all depends on the nickel look time. Okay, yeah. because I know uh, I submitted one yesterday to uh, get a permit and uh, 
they got flooded with them. So uh, my listing got pushed down pretty far, pretty quick. Uh, yeah, they're Let, me take, a a little bit Let me take a look at it really quick. One second. One second. I'll be in the for just a second, I'll be in my head. Say you applied for Fire Blossoms? Uh, yeah, I, sent, I submitted a Form A for a permit license, what, yesterday? Late yesterday? Yeah, oh, okay. Holy. You guys gotta slow down. Get in your fucking knees, get in your fucking knees now. Get in your fucking knees. Chris, you no, what are you doing, bro? Fucking knees. You can't do this here, bro. Get in fucking knees. Get in your knees, bro. You are. Hello? 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 Get your fucking knees, I'm going to call the police if you continue to have a gun in the safe zone. Postman got a gun. Mark's got a gun. Arrest him. He, he, no, he stole my car. If he stole your car, just get it back if it's here. Great, now there's dudes that... I don't know if the guy fled to a safe zone, which you're not able to do, or what, but there was a car full of like four guys that jumped out. One of them pulled a gun on another dude saying, okay, now there's gunshots over here. Okay, wow. All right, there's a lot going on over at the bank. Hey, Leo, did you hear that glass break? I think someone was breaking in shit. Oh, uh, yeah, I heard a little okay. bit. Um, so here, this is what we'll do. I'll, I'll keep my crates in the bedroom. You, cre you keep your crates over here. Leo. That way we all turn in our own crates only. Okay, that works. And then Phil can keep his crates in the center. Well, I only have one crate, so... <laughs> nah, nah, we got way more than that. I'll let you use all my... Where, where do you guys buy more crates at? I think I got shafted at the bank. So you're not supposed to get cheated at the bank, the government said. Okay, well I paid 5000 for two. That's not bad. That's actually, that's a good price. That's like, that's smack dab on the money. Like, that's what price is. Okay, alright, well that's not bad. Yeah, they usually go about 2.5, 3k. Yeah. Unless you're me, I got a steal earlier. What the hell just Whoa. happened? I just got stuck inside something. What is going on? You was it just me or did this uh that uh, that thing like warped kind of... upwards and it was i don't know it was odd, odd yeah that uh vehicle like warped up and flipped out and it was crazy oh, yeah my fucking vehicle looks like it's hurt really bad this could be a pretty good outcome how many crates did you get marcus um i have a like how many do i have yeah to turn in uh four and then inventory okay yeah same it should be about 3k per crate. If you got like halfway decent stuff. Yeah, I got three crates, my inventory, and then my car. Hell yeah. Jesus, a stack of 150 iron is 2,000? Iron is selling for some of the cheapest right now. Okay, so uh, yeah, I think as soon as I get the Granger, so I have some more, uh, you know, trunk space, I'm uh, going to uh, do this line of work because that was like fourteen, fifteen thousand dollars 15000 Yeah, it's a lot faster. Because, uh, ooh, actually, what I could do, since I'm at like 60000 now, all I gotta do is sell my car and I can get a, a brand new Granger if oh, I can't find one. Oh, that's a really good idea actually, yeah. And uh, can you get custom plates? Because I would love to have one, say G-Bear or can. something. Yeah. Ooh, everybody okay? <laughs> they gone. Damn, I didn't I'd see you at all, you good? Yeah, I'm good, but <laughs> they you can me, you like the car for you. I can, I, I'm really good at starting these things. Yeah, you can nah, take his I'm word good. for it. He starts mine all the time. Um, it's a one time, I promise. <laughs> How fast were you going? Here, I'll even, I'll even unlock this thing. There, see, my RV's unlocked. Okay, he's got it. He's got it. 
Yeah, that man was sketched Yeah, out. I was like, how fast do you think he was going? No, oh, probably like hundreds. Okay. Bro, he did nothing to my fucking uh, RV. It's still perfect. I got such a good view of that happening, it was ridiculous. <laughs> Bro, it happened so fast I didn't realize what was going on. I almost just added insult to injury and smacked into him right after he smacked into you. Dude, I would be crying right now. When do you think a collision like that would knock his durability down to? Oh, probably like down 100, 200. Wait, Phil, so how many tickets, or active tickets, did you have? I don't know. Uh, is there a way that I can see? He didn't tell me. He just said enough that I was wanted for reckless driving. Oh, yeah, you would have to uh, go to the police desk at the department and type in, you know, the or, you know muscle memory a uh, certain command, and it'll show you how many tickets you have. Okay, well, yeah, he said that it's enough that he said no matter what... Uh, whether he arrested me now or I went to the police desk later, that uh, I would have to serve 10 days in jail. Oh, that's a long time, dude. You okay, so, uh, <laughs> yeah, you must have, I'm going to say, at least 20. Yeah, there's <laughs> a lot of times I just forget to put that cruise control on, you know. God, that's a lot of time. <laughs> oh, my God. Dude, you, you need to pay this. Okay, yeah, I'm at uh, 50,000 right now, so hopefully when the car sells, I'll be at 80,000. Or, well, 75,000, but yeah, I'm gonna go run and do some, uh, just some transport vehicle work and try to, you know, get that last 10, 15,000. Okay, that dude was persistent. Oh yeah, so uh, I guess what kind of uh, water guns you talking about? Mm. Okay, I'm interested in the 50. Do you have any ammo? What was that? You're a little quiet. All right, uh, here, give me one second. So, uh, you have a 50 already with ammo? Oh, this is, uh, Leo, Marcus's brother. Oh, Leo, how's it going, my man? Going all right. I was actually just trying to, uh, just semi make it look like I'm talking to somebody because this random dude walked up to me and asked if I wanted to buy any guns. So, uh, yeah, I'm kind of just uh, putting my hand up to my ear, making conversation, and then, uh, oh, he laughs. So maybe he can actually also hear me? I'm not sure. Yeah, I think I think you can, when you're talking on the radio, uh, people by you can still hear you. Oh, well, then uh, this went really well. I'm just going to, since he can already hear me, bye. <laughs> uh, I, uh, what are you up to? I'm at the mine. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, I'm just trying to uh, make some money, but yeah, that guy laughed again, so uh, that was uh, pointless. <laughs> I was all That's trying funny. to be sneaky, and uh, he's just laughing. I'm like, oh, okay, damn. Yeah, yeah. Do you have uh, the keys to the RV? Um, I don't remember if he did give me keys or not. I don't like this road at all. I've never taken this route before, and I've transported a lot of money to ATMs. Ooh. Apparently someone else uh, doesn't like this road either. He didn't uh, fare as well as uh, I guess I'm currently doing. Uh, ooh, don't speak uh, too soon. <laughs> Would have barely made it past uh, where he made it. But uh, let's uh, never take that route again. We'll just try to now we know to take this back. Oh, how about we just watch the road instead of, uh, yeah. We just will avoid <laughs> this drop-off. Next point to take, uh, a not-so-sketchy route. We will purposely not forego 
what GPS tells us. And uh, take roads. Actually, that's still kind of sketchy. Come on. Oh my god, is this seriously the location? We could have easily just taken the highway and gotten here. It would have been probably a little faster. Definitely much easier of a route. I've delivered to this location before and it has never taken me the way it just did. Oh my god, that was by far the worst, most challenging route I have ever had during this job so far. This better be like a $1,000 delivery. That was... Oh my god, 692. I was hoping it was at least going to be 800 because that's what it felt like, but oh god, we are never taking that route again. I will purposely ignore the route and take the highway to get to this location. There, my bad. I uh, was asking a guy to go, uh, give me a ride to the, the cheapo car lot because uh, I uh, just quit the transport job so I can uh, go get my vehicle back from the lot and then head up to the uh, toll booth. Oh, uh, the uh, the cheapo uh, car sales lot on the, I guess, far south of uh, the city. If you're uh, aware with the location, I guess. Yeah. Uh, yeah, if you don't mind. Oh, let me hop out. Okay. What you okay? What was that? What was that? You <laughs> tried speeding past someone who was turning. Yeah! I didn't know you were turning. You didn't have your turn signal on. You literally just died like five minutes ago. <laughs> you need me to call the medic? Cops, please. Cop? Oh, there's one right there. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, they ran over my bike. <laughs> oh, jeez. You know, I get robbed, I get fucking rammed, like, what else can go wrong today? Just to, uh, I can lie to the cops and they can arrest you if you wanted to get a little worse. Uh, I'm not on scene, can I clear? What? <laughs> hey officer, are you, uh, calling in a medic? Okay, what happened here? He was uh, turning, and I tried to go around him, and I got flung into a pillar. Yeah, that sounds about right. There you go. Oh yeah, no problem. Thanks for the ride. Yeah, what's up? Yeah, I did. Oh, yeah, no problem. I'm. I always, you know, I, I'm a firm believer in karma, and I try to give people rides as well whenever I can. So, uh, since you were able to give me a ride, kind of out of your way, uh, wanted to make it worth your while. And uh, what's your name? Yeah, my name is uh, yeah, Leo Larson. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. I, uh, I got your name in my member bank. Um, is not, he, he's oh, not, he's pretty, he's just fucking always getting injured. Hey. Yeah, I'm good. I uh, just uh, did a really poor job about uh, hurting that little barricade there. What was that? Right. If you would be down for quick dice or so. Quick dice. Uh, yeah, dice Yeah, why not? Is that our Thomas you're talking about? Oh fuck, I'm already in bed. Ah, gotcha. <laughs> Appreciate it. Look, now you may double. I've used my
Okay, so that was pretty legit. I uh, dice rolled my first customer at the booth, and uh, since I beat him, he rolled a one, I rolled a three. He paid double to get through the toll booth. But uh, yeah, it was just a, a double or nothing type of thing. Oh, Yo, what the okay. Fuck? I just got ran over a little bit. Ooh. Thanks, man. Jump you gonna I guess that's why you keep your whole body inside the booth. I was halfway out and uh, he <laughs> knocked me down. Thanks. See you good, man? Yeah, I'm good. Uh, luckily, it was only half my body sticking out of the booth, so uh, he wasn't be able to get my body underneath that heavy ass vehicle. <laughs> 